Hello my loyal viewers. It's probably my last video of 2015. You might hear in my voice that I'm a little bit sick. I've been sick for like a week and uh, just a cold, but it's annoying. And I've been resting and not making a lot of videos. Um, and doing Christmas stuff because it's Christmas time and there's always so much family to see and stuff. Uh, recap of the year, I've made 27 videos. I wanted to make 52, which means I'm 25 short. According to my earlier vlog, um, I require punishment in the form of making a really long video to make up for all the videos I've missed. I believe what I said in that earlier video was 15 minutes per missed video, which would put my punishment video at about 6 hours and 15 minutes. Since it's a 6 hour long video, I was thinking that I would stream it and anyone who wanted to stop in and say hi or have a conversation would be welcome to do so. I think that would be a lot of fun. I don't know if anyone will show up to my party, <laughs> but I'd like to do it anyway so that I can look at the camera and say, where are you people in my life? So then the question is, when am I going to do it? Well, I could do it as soon as I get home from New Year's Reveling, which would probably be around 1 a.m. and that would have the advantage of sleep deprivation, which I guess is an advantage to some people. And it might make it slightly more likely that I would see some people stopping in for at least the first few minutes. Or I could get up really early in the morning, like at 4 or 5 or it's New Year's, so 6 is still pretty early, and I could make it then which I would probably not see anyone if I were streaming it. Let's be honest, no one's getting up at six to talk to me. Mm -mm. That would be the best chance to actually get the video in before, you know, schedules and plans that have been made because we have a baby and we have a big family. Tradition. I blocked the light when I did that. Tradition. Anyway, the third option would be to do it as late in the day as I can without conflicting with anything. Um, I'd have to let you know how late I can do that. Or hold it off and do it another day. If you have an opinion about what I should do, uh, put it in the comments. I will definitely let you know when I'm going to do this uh, before, you know, I do it, I guess. And that's, you know, like the end of the day because it's, it's New Year's Eve already. Cool! Alright, so we're talking about the uh, year wrap-up of my vlogging fun, which means it's time to start planning for next year. What am I going to do? First question, should I continue vlogging? Or should I focus my creative type energies towards something else, like writing? As some of you may know, I have a short story blog that has two short stories and a monologue in it currently. Instead of making videos, I could focus on that and try to write a short story or a monologue every month or two weeks or something. Or I could keep vlogging. I probably can't realistically do both with all the things going on in my life. So it's a choice between the two. If I do keep vlogging, do you think that I should uh, attempt to refocus on doing monologues, continue making uh, ranting videos about my opinions and thoughts about the world because I'm such an expert at everything and you should listen to me. Mm. Um, or do you try to be sillier? Silliness! Mix of all of the above, A, B, C, or all of the above. Uh, leave your thoughts in the comments whether you think I should keep vlogging or do more writing and whether you think that my vlogging should be uh, more acting, more silliness, or more seriousness. That's all I have to say right now. Uh, thank you, those of you that have actually been watching my videos this year. Um, I know it's not many of you, and um, the comments I have gotten, and the thumbs up I have gotten, and the, uh, the views I've gotten, I appreciate every one of them. So thank you for uh, bearing with me. Thank you for watching my videos and have a wonderful and lovely new year. Okay, all right. Yeah, I'm gonna go now. Bye.